Oh, pressure coming. Sacked! He is dropped by Komoko Ture. The ferocious Komoko Ture is in the house. 54 tackles on the year. Loves to get into the enemy backfield. Yep. Is there anything better than a sack in your mind, Komoko? Ah, oh, just, uh, just pressuring the quarterback <laughs> and just go out, just having fun and just getting a tackle for loss. How do you go after the quarterback? Do you try to figure out a way to go to the outside or the inside, or do you really read things? I uh, try to critique on uh, how the old lineman moves and stuff like that, and just watch film and how to um, back set and stuff like that, and just try to find their weakness and just try to execute it. When you look at the fact that you've had 54 tackles this year, right. you forced a fumble, you've had a fumble recovery, you've done a little bit of everything, you've gotten into the opponent's backfield, do you feel it's been a productive season? Most definitely. Um, um, having reached the goal that I said I was going with, with the sacks, but you know, just being a first and second down player, uh, I've, I'll say I, I completed most of my goals. Gets hog tied, Komoko Ture. He's done it again. So on third down and long, Rutgers bringing four. George in trouble, and down he goes. A sack back inside the 20-yard line. Second sack for Rutgers. And I think you've got talent, right. and you're playing to your talent. How have you done it in terms of preparation, work ethic, things like that? Oh, just started with spring ball, you know, just um, just taking coaching, listening to Coach Ashton, um, they helped me prepare uh, for this year, and um, the importance of for me having uh, being a senior and being a, uh, being an impact player or being uh, an example of the kids that's coming up next year and stuff like that. So I just took that, you know, just took the message and just focused in and just try to take coaching and how to be the first and second down and um, execute. Is this it for you this Saturday? No, sir. Hope, hoping, hoping God got a plan for me to go to the next level, you know, and then um, showcase my talent and uh, improve and um, just learn everything I learned here and just take it to the league. How special has it been to represent Rutgers here and being a Jersey guy, playing at Barringer, being from Newark, to have the opportunity to go to the State University? It's been great. Um, home, close, you know, 40 minutes from mom and dad. Uh, you know, just you know, showcasing your, showcasing yourself you know, around your family and stuff like that, and then people you know, and your own fans, your your home native and stuff like that is is a great feeling. I think about the highlight of your career at Rutgers had to be against Michigan, the block. Michigan's threatening to take the lead, yep. and Rutgers ends up getting their first Big Ten win. What was that moment like? <sighs> that moment, wow! Like, I was shocked. Like, um. I was shocked. Like, I never seen that atmosphere in my life. When I blocked that field goal, everybody just storming in, on the field. And it's just like, it was just a great feeling. Do you remember what you said running around that field? 55 yards center of the field. Good snap, good spot. Kick is blocked. They did it again. And guess who? <laughs> it's Kamoku Ture who got his hand up and blocked it. And the Scarlet Knights have done it again. History in the making. History in the making. Was that was that a great moment? That was a great moment. Uh, never forgot it. Um, it's gonna be lived on forever. Uh, hope I could you know make that magic happen again one day. Do you think Coach Ash is building something special here? He is. Um, coming from him coming here la last year and try to start on. Building, building and try to build character into the team. Uh, comparing to this year and the last year, he really did a good job. Kamoko, you've been in the trenches with these seniors for a long time, and to be out there and to share the moment with them on Saturday, that's gotta be special. Yes, it is. Um, it is. Um, being with uh, Sebastian for four years, the Darnell, um, you know, and the transfers, Gus, and getting to know all of them is, it's been a wonderful year. Friends for life, you think? Friends for life. And, um, I'm a sociable guy, so these guys, um, it's going to be brotherhood forever. Kamoko Ture has said that he doesn't expect this to be his final football game on Saturday. And you know what? I don't think so either, because you've got the ferocity, the toughness, the mental toughness, and physical toughness. Right and the love for the game that I think can propel you to the next level. So good luck. Will Thank you please you. buy me a dinner if you do make it most to the definitely, pros? Most definitely. Don't leave me hanging. Yeah, I won't. <laughs> Kamoko Ture of the Scarlet Knights, a defensive end who plays with pride and passion. More our football with Chris Ash just ahead.